Do you feel that you dress in a certain way just so you can fit with the people around you? Do you feel that you dress in a bland or frumpy way because you are uncertain what is your personal style is? Just know that you're not alone feeling that way. Let's talk about this in this video. I'm in fact a fashion designer and a personal style coach. In this channel, I'm sharing with you practical tips how to find confidence in your style again. If you are interested in this topic and you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll be notified every time I post a new video. Where do I start? We all have a style. The only question if it's express or not. For women to talk about the struggle with their own personal style, it's not easy thing to do and it's understandable because we grew up all our life hearing since we was little girls how we supposed to look growing up we have all this influence from the magazine from tv with really high pressure if we think about telling us how we should fit into this unwritten society norms such a high standard and expectation from us right they tell us that we're supposed to look like a models that they look so skinny and look like they're starving themselves that we should count the calories of what we're eating instead of really teaching us how to eat healthy how to have a healthy lifestyle we worry about how much we weight. They tell us that we always need to look young. We need to suggest in us that we need to fill our face with Botox. They suggest in us that we'll wear heels. And let's be honest, it's the most uncomfortable things to do. Am I right? It's hurting our back, but hey, it's so beautiful right they tell us that we need to dye our hair every two to three freaking weeks because we must not join our gray hair we won't look again beautiful and young and we have all those things we hear and since we was a little girls right we have all this pressure how we should think how we should look and it just too much is not the reality all the advertising in the magazine and the tv show it's not real life they're confusing us they make us feel insecure uncertain and disconnected to ourselves, and even bullying self-image and i can go on and on okay and really not to be authentic as we're supposed to be is what we feel happy instead they make us feel shame of who we are the saddest part is when you are not allowed yourself to express your authentic true self throughout the clothing or any area in life what you're doing you lowering your energy and it's affect your body language it's affect your the entire day how you productive it's make you feel insecure about yourself we are as a human being we are always trying to protect ourselves fit in just that we don't feel rejected okay it's natural for us to really hide instead of really show up exactly as we are because i work with many women who are struggling expressing their own personal style i know that it's very common subject among women it doesn't 
matter if you are a very successful businesswoman, if you're an entrepreneur, if you're a homestay mom, or even retired. It really doesn't matter. Working with many of my clients and when I'm asking our members what is the reason why they not really expressing their own personal style. I got many responses and here are some of them. All my life, I've been told how to dress up. I had to dress in a certain way to school. I had to dress in a certain way when I went to the church. Growing up, I had to dress in a dress code to work. Now, after many years of dress code, I'm uncertain what is my personal style is. I'm not sure what clothes I should wear that will make me happy and how to express my true personal style. Another member saying, most of the colors of my clothes are black and gray because that way I feel safe. I feel comfortable to blend in with others. I don't feel comfortable if I will be in the center of attention. But I don't feel that my style is aligned with my personality. I really like to wear dresses and to dress in more colors but I'm too nervous to do it. It really pains me to hear all those negative comments. Why women's style need to associate with such a negative feeling? Why do we need to feel like we always need to fit in? Take inspiration from one of our members in the group. I used to be in a style rut. I used to wear all the same outfit over and over again. I was so sick of my wardrobe and yet I didn't know what I wanted for my style. I wasn't sure how to create a stylish looks and put together. I was wearing the same colors, mostly black and gray all the time with very few accessories. I learned so much about style and I feel so much more confident. Now I am able to put outfit together. I am wearing a lot more colors and accessories. And I'm general feel much more confident. When we express in our true authentic self, our spirit fill the entire room. We laughing, we celebrating life and the freedom that we give ourselves. And people not just see it, they also feel our energy. You are definitely not alone and there are many women that feel the same. Our compassion community of women like-minded who share similar personal style journey make our group coaching program kickstart your style very powerful so come and join us if you like this video hit the like button and share it with women that may be beneficial from this topic i'm going to see you on my next video bye